Okay, prove that the product of any two odd numbers is always odd. Okay, so let's first try some examples. So try any two odd numbers. I'm going to do 3 times 7. That gives me 21. That's odd. Let's try something else. 9 times 17. That gives me 153. That is odd. So it's worked for two cases, but we now have to prove it for every case. So if we let one of the integers be 2n plus 1, then we... We're not looking for the uh, consecutive integers, we're looking for any two odd numbers, so we have to let the other one be 2m plus 1, where m stands for another integer. So this is one integer, this is another integer. So, for example, in the case of 3 and 7, n would be equal to uh, 1, and in the case of uh, this one, n would be equal to m would be equal to 3. Okay, so the product, because it says the product of two, any two odd numbers will be 2n plus 1 times 2m plus 1, so we can use a little bit of algebra to expand that. So that's 2n times 2m plus 1 plus 1 times 2m plus 1. So expanding, 2 times 2 gives me 4nm plus 2n plus 2m plus 1. Right, there's a common factor here in the first three terms only, so we'll factorise the first three terms only. It's a common factor of 2. We'll take out 2, and we'll be left with 2nm plus n plus m, and we've still got the plus 1 on the other. So we've got the sort of format of an odd number here, 2 something plus one if this is an integer there's something here then we have shown that this is an odd number so 2mn plus n plus m is actually an integer if you m and n to begin with were integers for example in this case here n was two and then in the case of this one here uh, m was three and therefore, if you do that, add those together, we would actually get an integer. So, so which we can now call this a different uh, value, k. So we'll call that all that k. And therefore, this can be written as 2k plus 1, which is the format for an odd number. Okay, so we have now proved that the product of t any two odd numbers is always odd. Okay, I hope you've understood. And I thank you very much for watching.